Hello to the lovely people out there and welcome to the first episode of Frostpunk 1, not 2, that 2 is for, they're giving some credits for when Frostpunk 2 comes out. Uh, anyway, so Frostpunk 1, this is a game that a friend of mine actually told about, uh, the, same friend that, the same friend that actually told me about uh, this war of mine, it's from the same studio. And he loved this game, so we're gonna give it a try. Let me just check the graphics. 4K, everything is at very high, so that should be the one. Uh, choose the story in new home. I have opened this game before, I've not played it, but did check it just to make sure everything is working properly before starting the first episode, but... We roam the still, cold world. No horizon in sight. The rulers of old, stripped of pride and glory. It feels as yesterday we were turning the wheels of progress. Until the frost stopped it all. Suddenly, without a warning. When tides had changed, they changed for all of us, no matter wealth or class. We've lost our world to snow. And with it, our last traces of humanity. So it's a survivor game, like strategic game. We bid farewell to plenty. And for those who remained, came the time to adapt. We decided to leave our homes and head north. We roamed for weeks, maybe months, leaving behind all the things we once believed had made us. It was hope that pushed us forward. Slowly, step by step, we knew the cost of our journey. And we paid the price a hundred times. Finally, the time has come to build the last city on Earth. What a lovely intro with a lovely voice. His sound was amazing. A new home, we fled from London and crossed the sea to reach the frozen north. On the way, our convoy was hit by a blizzard and scattered. A handful of us managed to reach the site of this generator, only to find it frozen, solid, and abandoned. Why is no one here? Did any of our people survive the blizzard? Are there any others out there? Whatever we do, we should expect the worst now that the world as we know it has crumbled. We have to survive. There's no other option. I like the idea. Uh, so there's a generator and it's also frozen. Okay, I have no idea how to play this game. I have like zero information. We need to get generator working. It provides heat and power to other buildings. Without it, we will freeze to death. Stockpile some coal and start the generator. Okay. Stockpile some coal. 200. Okay, save the game. A new save file. New save. Uh, okay. New save. If I say save, it will be the same name, so I have to rename it. Okay. That's cool. Turn the generator on. People are content. Okay, construction. How are the... Okay, not adjacent to the street. Ooh, boy. Cap 
capacity. What's that? Workforce will extract steel. Do you want to have any resources? There we go. We can move the camera with your mouse while holding the right mouse button. You can also use the double SD keys to adjust the mouse to the edge of the screen. To zoom in and out, use the mouse wheel to rotate the camera, press the mouse wheel and move the mouse or use Q and E. Okay. Uh, lovely. Okay, middle, the, okay, the right key plus that will change the camera, which is the same as the arrows, apparently. Zoom in and out, okay, that makes sense, that's pretty much the same narrator game. Resources and workforce. Resource management is crucial to the city's survival. You need coal to power the generator. Wood and steel are necessary for construction and research. Steam pores are a key part of advanced buildings. Raw food is used to prepare food rations in the cookhouse. Later in the game, more resources types may appear. Most buildings require you to assign people. Oh, workers available, I see. Most buildings require to assign people to work there. Certain buildings only employ engineers and others only employ workers to assign people to work. Click on a workforce and use the assignment panel. Okay, you click on a coal pile, for example. Workers, engineers. Um, oh, it this one accepts both of them and you can assign from either of them okay how many i don't have any coal i have a bit of steel and wood steam cores one raw food food ration day one okay max it out now people are gonna give their 80 homeless people Okay, tent needs 10 woods. Oh, when you click on construction, the game pauses apparently. Okay, that's actually pretty nice. And people are building it. Remaining time about two hours. Oh, it's in game two hours. Every second is. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Every five seconds is ten minutes, so every second is like two minutes. Okay, how about that? Uh, that also is wood, so that's nice. 60, what's that? Wood's 120. 60. I have a feeling that I'm gonna need the woods a bit more. We'll extract wood potential six per hour. Oh, okay. Uh, so maybe I don't need the full thing. Ooh, I need a lot more than that, apparently. Every house is gonna... Seems to be for higher levels. How about more coal? Build a coal mine here to start extraction. Okay. Well, okay, nothing new. We have. Okay, see, it's not copy. Six per hour, and the max is 118 or something. Okay, people are bringing coal. Oh, that is coal. Okay, good. 18 per hour. How about the uh, people, health, medical post, food, 20 woods, not adjacent to streets. So can I make streets? Resources. That's something that I don't like. 
I don't understand how the build street. There we go. Building streets. Did you build it or not? That's a bit confusing. Either me or them. Okay. That's being built. Apparently. And food. Is it going to leave enough space in between them or what? How many workers do I have? Where do you show the work? Time six. It's the menu. Okay. Is this poor lad? No home. Yep, building roads. Wonder if that will mess up the road or not. Apparently not. Okay, that's good. First do I have how do you see that? Twenty-eight out of eighty. Okay, I see. Prohibited fifteen. That seems a little bit far. Woods would steal. Why not let do three there? What's going on? The heating is off, the generator is off. People are afraid they'll freeze to death and they're in their sleep if you don't at least turn it on for the night. Of course. Uh, okay. The maximum amount that I have available. Engineers. How many engineers do I have? Storage, worker. Do I have engineers? Idle engineer, 15 in total. Idle workers. What is... Oh, children. 15 children, 50 workers. Okay, 15, 15, 3, 7. Oh crap. Shouldn't have spent it that much on that. Pull 150. Can I turn it on? Shut down steam level one. Okay. Temperature. Steam level two. Oh, okay, it has a range. Oh, resource. Okay, controlling time. Okay, uh, that's lovely. There we go. Uh, this one of mine didn't have anything that would pass time forward a bit faster. That's that's great. You can speed up time by clicking. Game speed buttons found to the left of the temperature at the top of the screen. You can also bind Q. Or shortcuts the game speed on OK, which can be accessed by clicking on the icon. The game will slow down to normal speed when something important happens, as well as each day at 5. You 
can pause the game by pressing the spacebar. Oh, okay, makes sense. Construction. Use the construction menu at the bottom of the screen to order the construction or dismantling of buildings and streets. Only people who are not currently at work can build structure. Valid place invalid placement. Buildings inside the heat zone are warmer and provide better living and work conditions. To make the best use of heat zone, buildings are placed in a radial grid. All buildings must be connected to the generator by a street in order to function. Makes sense. Generator. The generator is the heart of the city and only source of heat in the f in this frozen hole. You should turn it on as soon as you stockpile enough coal. The generator heats a circular zone around it, consuming at least six units of coal per hour. You can research generator upgrades that raise the heat output, expand the heat zone, and reduce coal usage. That's something important to use. Hunger. Number of hunger is starving people. Hunters boast efficiency 50 raw food per day. Hot house efficiency 30 raw food per day. That's a lot more. Two food rations per raw foot unit per how much time? Efficiency. Cook house. The cook house prepares meals for people. It produces two food rations from one unit of raw food. Provided by hunters and hot houses and is sometimes found by scouts during the exploration when there are no food rations to be had. People will start eating raw food. Ooh. Temperature. Okay. Comfortable is red. Leaveable. Chilly, cold, very cold, freezing. It's this the wavelength spectrum from red to violet. Makes sense. Okay, that's that's cool. Uh, sorry, I just wanna keep saving the game because I don't wanna, you know, have to go back and start from the beginning if I make a stupid mistake. Hey, Doki. If I click on that, how did you choose temperature? Oh, if you click on that, this is comfortable. These are leaveable. And apparently they don't work during the night. Is that true? Illness and healthcare. Cold homes or workplaces cause people to get sick. Without proper care, they can become gravely ill and might die. The sick can be treated in medical posts, but the gravely ill need an infirm infirmary to be treated. Medical post care has infirmary. Until you build one, you can save their lives by signing one of two lies. The radical treatment law allows you to treat the gravely ill in medical posts, but some of them will be left as amputees. Sustain life law allows you to keep the gravely ill alive, but untreated in medical posts or care house indefinitely. Oh shit. The gravely ill can be kept alive when sustained life law is medical treatment. Medical post, but some of them will be. Hmm. You might have to cut a leg or arm or something. Wow, that's a fucking hard choice to make. And. I have a feeling that only this guy is working. And two raw foods. Storage. Workers. Oh, wow, all of them have name? Let me check something. My guess is that... They work at night, but only in that zone. One sick. Zero gravely. Health. Medical post. I don't have enough that. If I pause it, will you give me the words? Nope. No shit. Hmm. 
Not researcher, you need 12 coal to turn this level on to temperature and all. It sounds 200% coal consumption. Shit. Range setting, not researched yet. Oh shit, four sick. How much did I spend for each tent? This one needed 25. Yep, I just spent it. Two of that. Why are people getting sick that much? And why is it that no one is working? When are you gonna start working? Disconnect. Lack of shelter. And keep going like this for a while, I'd say. At least we're alive, not everyone's so lucky. Six. Guys, why aren't you working? When do you start working? Whoa, what did I do? Find ways. Books of laws. Uh, hold on, did I press that 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 happened? Day night cycle. I pressed number two. The city wakes up at 6 in the morning. People have some free time until the work shift starts at 8. Unless there is construction work to do after they finish their shift at 18, they are free to help with construction again, which can keep them up well past midnight. You can extend the 10 hour work shift if you sign certain laws. Sleep time, free time, work time, free time, initial daily routine. Timeline. After signing the extended shift and ex emergency shift laws, you can extend your people's work time. Shift time switch. Where do you assign that? You can always disable tutorials in the settings. Um. Don't press one. Press two. Adaption. Radical treatment. Sustain life. Soup, food additives, fighting area, emergency shift. Okay, extended shifts, child labor, safe jobs, child shelters, cemetery, corpse disposal, funeral organ, organ trans plants, extra rations. For the eel overcrowding, I can put that. Okay, child labor safe jobs. There aren't enough hands to do all the work. Will allow children to be employed in safe workforces like cookhouses or hot houses. Okay. Hurt. Surely we'll find a very way to educate some of them. Uh, guys. Okay, that was new. Wait, and wait, 17th, what? Emergency shift. What is that? Why can't I do the extended shifts? Okay. Zero, oh, 17 days, okay. Sorry, 17 hours, zero days and 17 hours. Okay, they are apparently up to work. work time. Get moving. How much? Engineers, can I have? Okay, wait a second. Engineers, children, not gonna send children's coal. First, that is not gonna happen. Um, they need engineers, so I'm gonna reduce that to get a few children's, and then max out that one. Then we're gonna build a medical post, 
and people maybe build a tent too. We're out of wood. I know. Don't worry. Oh, there was an autosave. Okay, that's good. I think every day it's gonna autosave. Um, lack of shelter. On me. Coal pile is good. Daily gain. Coal pile, there's three of them. Efficiency, daily gain. Wood, steel, food processing. Health status, not very good. Tent, comfortable. I'm a citizen, I need four more tent. Um, how many raw food did I have? And how much food do I use? The generator hums with reassuring warmth, but we shouldn't take it for granted. If the generator goes down, the city dies. Be mindful of coal reserves. Now, food. There will be no city if you starve to death. Secure a way to promote raw food and build a cookhouse to prepare a meal. Yep, I've done that. Hope goes up. Build a cookhouse and start preparing meals. Secure raw food supply. Build a hunter's hut or a hut house. Food. I don't have the other one. Okay. They need to be connected to a street. Is that connected to those trees? That's what I'm thinking. Okay, like... Coal mine. Hunter's hut. You know what, I'm gonna build a... here. And oh, low risk of failing ill could not resume production, requires raw food. Okay, well, we'll try to deal with that. I guess there's nothing for me to do until the day is over. Doing a bit of steam course. How do you research that? Full consumption, six per hour. Functioning, not functioning, basically. Um, Book of pause. Cool down. Economy. How's the food consumption? Daily gain 400. Workforce status efficiency. Food consumption 80 per day. Holy crap. 80 per day. Okay, I can do two days. Not ideal, that's for sure. I feel we can turn this off at certain times and points, I guess? People from our convoy, with basic resources secured for now, we can try to rescue the people who left behind, build a beacon, scout Frostland, and save as many survivors from our expedition as possible. You'll need a workforce to design plans for more advanced buildings. Build workshop, build the beacon, rescue survivors of our lost expedition. Okay.
Wait, why is no one? Oh, people built that. Oh crap! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, how many more tents do I need? Three. Which means thirty wits. Okay, build that for now. So I don't have so many homeless people. Um, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, number of employees available. Still about that. Medical post two available. Oh, they only can use workers, so that's the hunters. Okay, I'm gonna need food, so do that. Uh, resources, gathering post. Please hit and level. What does that do? Not adjacent to street. Ten one sick. It's content. Oh. Five being treated. Can introduce a new law. All jobs. Medic apprentice engineers apprentices. Not gonna sign that, that's for sure. Emergency shifts. Sometimes I have to concentrate on the task at hand at the cost of everything else or die. You can force workers in any facility to work for the next 24 hours. Raise discontent. Discontent will rise slightly. I don't need to do that. After introducing this law, another one can be passed after the new building. Fighting arena evening bouts will reduce discontent. You will have to build a fighting arena. Food additive. Hope will fall slightly. Discontent will rise slightly. Some people eating sawdust meals will fall ill. make them more filling, although not exactly tasty or healthy. To feed more people with the same amount of raw food. Hope will fall, discontent will rise, eating so will cause discontent. Okay. Every now and then you can use that, I guess, to reduce that amount if things get shitty. But, back to construction. People, tent, health. Medical post, tech, build a workshop. Lovely. Don't think anyone's gonna build that until six in the morning. Two people are sick. Three people are sick. Did something happen? Oh, it's five in the morning. It only need it only uses engineers. Get to work. We can let up now. At least we're alive. Not everyone's so lucky. Okay. Did you do me another auto save? Day three. Oh, auto save override stuff. Huh? Yep. Oh, it's a challenging game. Sick absences. Oh, shit. Some buildings, such as medical posts or workshop, requires intense mental labor from the people employed there. And as such, can only be staffed by engineers. Workers only provide manual labor. Children can be employed at all initially. You can check your workforce distribution by clicking on the icon in the bottom right corner. There's an engineers, hunters only employs workers, and that one only employs that. Hunters. 
15 raw food per day. Wait, what the? Research upgrades to significantly raise the hunt yield. 15 raw food per day is gonna be 30 food or rations, and I use 80 per day. Like, I need three of these to be able to survive. They work from 6 p.m. until 6 a.m. Initially, they will bring up to 15 units of raw food from each other. Research offices and there's... Oh. Efficiency over 24% of absent. Over 50%. Oh, shit. Okay, workshop. And this is hunting four per day. That is not going to be nearly enough. Needs workers. Need four more. Can put children to work there? That doesn't seem like a safe thing. What? Seven hours, at least 100% research rate, 20 wood, 35 steel. Good. Resources fast. Dirt gathering, coal thumpers, some will still work. 10 woods, 7 hours. Faster coal, still. No food. Hunter. 20 raw food per hunt, 10 woods, employees, engineers. Uh, hold on a second. Where are my freaking engineers? Max it out. Functioning. Dismantle but no. Uh, where did you do the research? How did you get this one, right? Yeah. Okay. I'll start with that one to get more food. Got seven hours. Thanks to better snowshoes and enhanced hunters setting up from up to 20 raw food per hunt. Then I would say. 15% faster when using gathering post or not. Okay, that's the use of the gathering post. Okay, here's the thing. I'm gonna be messed up for the food. Due to soap. Hope is reduced a bit, discontent. Promises anything to come to ground, so just like in London. Buddy, it's not fucking London, okay? What else do we have? Hunting, household insulations. Flying hunters? Okay. Medical post upgrades. Faster gathering. This one needs a lot of stuff. Needs a lot of steel. Theme. Can I do two at the same time? Is that what you're telling me? Nope, I cannot. These contraptions create additional smaller heat zone around them. Each active 
unmodified steam hub consumes three coal per hour. Okay, a tinier thing. Crafting machines. Drawing boards allows us to research tier one technologies. Oh, okay. I have to upgrade itself to be able to access to those. Coal thumper allows us to build coal thumpers by pumping pressurized water into the underground coal deposit. The coal thumper washes the precious resource to the surface, forming a pile of up to 560 coal per standard work day enough for two gathering posts. Some will turns frozen trees into usable material, producing up to 80 wood per standard work day. Extracts iron ore from deep deposits and crosses it to deliver up to 40 steel per standard work day. Okay. Heaters. Uh, allows us to use heaters to heat workplaces during working hours. Each heater raises the work workplace's temperature by one level and consumes one coal per hour when running. Um, sorry, one thing. Heaters. Workplaces. So, the negative thing is that I guess for these guys, they have to go back and forth. And what you can do is build gathering post. Like something like this one. No, this is some steel. And what I can do is to say none max here. And then build a road, I guess, first. going on. Switch between buildings. What's that? Use the workshop to develop new buildings and improvements. You can boost research speed by building several workshops. One workshop up to 100 research speed, 130 research speed. Okay. Research is grouped in tiers. You have to research in tier upgrade before you can start research technology in that tier regarding each topic because research and takes time. Okay, if I build two more, everything is going to be done 50% fast decision between buildings. By clicking on the arrows to the left and right in the upper part of the building panel, you can quickly cycle through all the buildings of the same type. Oh, there's a click, there's a arrow there. When your city starts getting bigger and you want to check the condition of all your healthcare facilities, for example. Okay going on their family torn apart sir a woman came forward after we built the workshop she said that her husband and daughter didn't reach the city with the main group but she's sure they're still out there she wants to join the first scout team we'll send out she'll urges you to hurry we'll do what we can how do I do that what's that uh No. A child got distracted at work and has been injured. This accident was not serious and happened totally due to the child's careless. Day off. It's okay, it happens. Um. 
crap, this is a hard game. I can feel it. Um, okay, they're building the road. Still working hours. Okay, what's going on? Falling ill. No, that one. It's coal. Do I have coal here? I wish I had. This is also coal. That is also coal. Huh. Something else I can do. Probably not the best idea ever, but we'll see how things end up. Cookhouse Hunter. Oh shit. Did not see that. Gathering Post uses five steel. Gear researched. Nice. Okay, do another research. If they've got enough stuff. Ten woods. That's good. Was to use heaters to heat workplaces during working hours. Um, I don't need that really. I need this one. I don't have the steel for it. Faster gathering coal thumper. Okay, don't need that either, but I can use that. Also, I have quite a lot of coal and it seems that I'm doing a-okay. I need steel. In fact, I only have like four people there. It seems very much connected to me. You literally needed to go through that thing. Night is coming. Put down your tools. Under construction, okay. Weather changes. Oh, they want to day five. The thermometer icon indicates the duration of the temperature change. However, the mouse over it for details. When it gets colder outside, the temperature inside buildings drop as well. Buildings differ in the amount of protection they offer from the cold. You see all the factors affecting the panel in the building. Hover to mouse over temperature icon in the panel. That guy. Okay. So... Da 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 da... Temperature. To building insulation. Heat zone, building insulation, comfortable. Prevents fall, failing ill. I still have 10 people that are not housed. Streets. Street not connected to the generator. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, I see what you mean now. It's the other side of this. What you're knocking about. There we go. So hold on, if I say none, and if I say like three, what's the difference here?
I'm not sure how smart that was building that here. 36 wood, 55, still 30. 13 wood. That is almost dumb. That was pretty dumb. And I think it's not progressing, right? Yeah, research rate. How do you send out expeditions? Mother, oh, sorry, just one sec. A mother has refused to let her daughter to go to work, afraid she'll get injured. We could look the other way this time, but hers might see it as unfair. It is unfair, just because the mother, we won't make an exception. I'm sorry, darling, but we have to pull our own weights. Poor sick. Being treated in treatment. What does it mean to select? I'm not gonna risk that. I don't know what the hell that is. So, do, 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 in treatment, select. Get a move on, chaps. There's still plenty of work. Let's go to work. We can let. We can't let up now. Status. Click to rename. Huh. In treatment. Lack of shelter. Oh. Yeah, I cannot build anything until tomorrow. Oh shit. It got so much colder. Oh crap. Well, it's getting cold with each day. I hope I don't freeze to death on duty. Very Time cold. I risk of falling ill. Oh shit 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 shit. Not good. Did not see that one coming. 19 still, 7 woods. Come on. Come on. Generator. Instructions they must be connected to the generator with streets, otherwise they won't function to build a street open the Yeah, I know that. Streets generator override. In extreme circumstances, the generator can be put into override. This will increase the heat it provides, but also put the generator under stress. Keep an eye on the stress gauge. When it reaches 100%, the generator will explode. I don't think that I need to do that because if I say override, it's not doing anything to that. Turn it off. that beacon. Come on. Ah. Plaster gathering research done. Oh, that's good. Um, cold steel wood. That's great. Beacon. 20, 35, I need 20 wood. 
Need 20 wood, guys. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. One of our people has become greatly to the frost by this will keep happening. People have to work in such cold. What was the difference? Radical treatment. The gravely will be treating the medical posts. Hope will rise slightly. 30% of the gravity of treating the medical posts will be left. Mute. One out of three. Discontent will rise slightly. The green will not be treated and remain a burden. The gravely ill will take up beds in the medical posts. Oh shit. Sign that. New law. A new law has passed. Got that. Controversial law. Can I stop the work? Like, I think so. Um, wood still coal. You know what? You guys, thirteen. Wood pile depleted. Great. I actually wood pile depleted. In fact, kind of good. How about that? That steel. Um. Don't work. Guys. Don't work. Don't work. End of shift. Go rest all who can. I have to survive until they're worldwide one level. I still have ten homeless people and I cannot. Something new. I have to build that at some point. Not now. And people that have no home. And sick shit. Takes them forever. If being treated this person is terminally ill, but being treated health, low risk of falling ill. Going. Whoa. Why so many people are only ill? Why is this one chillier than the other ones? I guess those ones don't have insulation. Together, wood, where's wood? Oh, shit. Don't see any wood. What am I supposed to do? I've only got 29 woods. 
Emit. Nope, that's got that. Send them to work. I literally have no other option. Get going. Okay. Time to earn your bread. And introduce a new law. You'll need to. Okay. In the wake of recent child workers' accident, the parents argued that we could give working children double rations to make them stronger and help prevent injuries. No, we can't afford that. Sorry, we'll deal with that later. Oh, that was a lot of wood suddenly. Okay. Uh, about three days, less than a day. Raw food, I have to build another that. Hunter. Wood crates depleted where that one. Mm -hmm. That's why I say it was a dumb thing that I did there. Okay. Max it out. I need woods. Allows us to build a beacon. Rescue survivors. That's something that I would very much like to do. 17 with three gravely ill uh, health medical post. They gotta Let's build it there then. Beacon. Does it matter where it is? Uh, I have no idea. Okay, let's assume that it does matter. Um, beacon resources. Don't have shit, but coal thumper. No, not that. Steam hub heaters, that's what I would like to have. Oh, it's 10 minutes. Heaters. 7 hours. Shit, it's not gonna be finished today. And I'm gonna run out of work today. Still depleted. Gathering push resources depleted. Damn. Thanks. Will be able to work. Care house, new building, care house. After introducing this lot, another one can be passed. Our kept alive in care houses are no longer burden than medical post. Residents of care houses eat half as much. Hope will rise slightly. You will have to build a new care house. Overcrowding. Our medical facility should be fully utilized, even if we have to put the patients on the floor. Using the extra rations will cause discontent. Discontent will rise. We can feed sick people extra rations to help with the recovery. Uh, I cannot do that. Sorry. Cannot build Hear anything me. right now. New law in the city. Didn't I build another of those? 
Yeah, that. Construction is gonna soon be done. Captain so far, people are concerned about the rising number of untreated sick. They're asking you to address I will open a new medical post. You'll have three days to build it. I promise the sick will be treated. That means one third of the sick I won't address any right now. Uh, I am planning to build one. It's just that people need to go to work. It's content. Ooh, not good. It's gonna get a bit warmer. The wisdom of the crowd. Captain, when facing demands, remember this. People usually look for the quickest solution, not the best one. You don't have to agree with everything they ask for. If you fix the problem your way, it's fine. I'll bear that in mind. Thank you. Damn, this game is does not joke around, man. You don't get to take a step wrong. 20 per day. I have to build one more of that too, which has to be actually... I did build one more of that, just dumb enough not to assign people to it. Only takes workers. From now on, our people will be able to survey the icy barrens that surrounds us frostland. Okay. We're sending out a balloon. That's uh, gonna help other people find us. We don't go out to find them. I think. Lost expedition, what should I do? Send scouts here to learn about it. How do you send scout? Open a new medical. Pick up the rescue. Okay, impute capacity 20 people for every care house, half rations per resident. I have to build that too. Number of amputes. Hope and discomfort. People's needs when they are not fulfilled. Discontent rises. Each law affects a new society. Buildings. Ability. Social stability of the city. There are many factors that can affect them. The most important ones are blah blah blah. Beacon. The beacon gives you access to the world outside the city. You can explore it with scouts deployed through the beacon panel. So for us lands with scouts, click on the beacon base to open the beacon panel and create scout teams. Needed to create, create a team. Hit. Okay, deploying scouts. Click on that, and you click on that, and you tell them to deploy yourself. Okay, so you click on that. No, not really that. How many woods do I need? None. Max that. Will you just give me a fuck? One of our babies facing death, but he's still refusing amputation. He keeps screaming that he doesn't want anyone to touch his leg and he won't change his mind, even though we will kill him in a matter of hours. Cut up his leg. We need. We needed a win. People cheer as the giant of the fishing balloons soar above the city. This is a real feat. Everyone feels proud of the work they've done to make it happen. Volunteers have lined up eager to go looking for lost people in Frostlands. The woman who came forward earlier is among them. Will you just give me a second? Temperatures and 
what now? Many buildings such as the cookhouse or medical posts must be at least chilly or warm inside to function. Place them in the heat zone around the generator or steam hub. And when it gets colder, you should also research and turn on heaters. That's something that I was researching. Okay. 29 woods. How does this thing work? 40 wood? God damn it. And five people. Max it out. Mm -hmm. Else. Good to none. I feel like it requires at least one work at not gathering resources in the range. Okay, with the steel. 10 available, 12 available. I'm not gonna send the children there. Engineers. Where do I have them? Five. I don't have many engineers left, do I? operational. No? Weather, cold. Turn it off. Don't have, have any food. 16 sick steam hub wait what what's that oh the cost of a steam hub is 20 steel I would rather do that House, medical post upgrade. I am not surviving this one. <laughs> Improved heater. Yep, I have to wait until tomorrow. There isn't really nothing I can do. 18 is sick. Fuck. Can't I make them? Healthcare promises were built. Okay, hope risers, thank you. Okay, temperature is improving a bit, that's nice. Four amputes, shit. Okay, I don't have anyone at call, do I? Um, that's fifteen on wood, no steel. Okay, send five there. I have to send the kids to work, don't I? If that's the case, I would rather have them do with the wood rather than the coal. But, Forty, come on. You know, I need five workers. Uh, 
Move city. Lost expedition. 11 hours to arrive. Scouts until sent to lost expedition. Okay. Heaters, use heaters at workspaces. How do I use that? Uh, that's not a workspace to have heater. Okay, 50 per hour. Workhouse. Oh no, we'll provide five foot rations from two raw food. Four from two. Um, I want to do this one. Full thumper. It's ten boots. I'll start researching that. At least I can get the time. Rose, no, this one is actually a lot more important. Yeah, that.